Hey guys, a couple days ago I asked you all to dare me to do different challenges inside of TDX, and today we're gonna give some of them a go. Now here's the first one. Play a game of intermediate mode, but you can't upgrade your towers. Sounds interesting. Let's get it. Now I'm not too sure if we can win with level zero towers, I doubt it, but I am interested to see how far we can get. If we can get past the predator boss, you know, I'll take that as a W. But even if we do get past the predator boss, how the heck are we supposed to get past the stealth charger bosses? There's three of them that come out on like wave 32 or whatever. How the heck am I killing those? And then we have all the bullet resistant enemies that, that we have to worry about as well. So we're going to have to micro the artillery and spam down mine layers for our best shot. Anyways, our early game is just consisting of laser gunner spam and two barracks to catch any leaks. Pretty simple early game. The main problem comes in the mid game to late game. Like I said, if we can get by the predator boss, that's a W man. The strategy I have in mind is filling this entire area with laser gunners. Hopefully that can deal with any stealth enemies and then over here we'll put down juggernauts, maybe some artillery. And then on the outer side of the path, we're going to put a lot of mine layers and hopefully that's enough. I'm going to go for about 10 to 12 laser gunners and then start working on our explosive towers. But yeah, this is a pretty interesting challenge. I haven't done this before. If you guys have any dares or challenges you would like to see me do on the channel, just let me know in the comments, man. As long as they're actually doable somewhat and or fun looking, I'll give them a shot. And then we're going to get our first artillery... Matter of fact, let's get two artilleries down. You know, we made it past wave 18. We're looking pretty good. Let's get our first juggernaut. Gonna help out against the monster that comes out uh, in a little bit. And we're gonna deal with the revived Titan. Like, that's one of the, the most annoying enemies in this whole run. The elite grenadier and the stealth charge bosses are, like, really scary. All right, mine layers plus artillery plus juggernaut should take this thing out, right? Uh... Barracks just sacrificed himself. W. We get a third artillery. I feel like this is a good spot. It's crazy. Like we have the best towers in the game, but because we can't upgrade them, we're struggling on wave 21 because of it. Now they can afford our next juggernaut, which will come in handy. Okay, double revive Titan. Okay, here comes the monster as well. We still haven't even dealt with the revive Titan yet, so this is uh concerning. I have a solution. It's called spam mine layers. Is the solution working? Kinda. It's kinda working. Right. Now, relying on the artillery to be half of our stealth detection with level zero laser gunners as well is pretty sketchy, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, get rid of that elite grenadier, please. There we go. They only spawned like a couple. That's not too bad. Okay, everything's gonna get pretty far. I'm a little afraid. Okay, we're good. We're good. Nice. Now we can just deal with the Predator. So I think we'll actually be able to kill it, guys. You know, beating my expectations for the challenge. Yeah, everything's dead except for the uh, except for the Predator. Alright, we have a little bit of money that we can spend. It's not all bad. But it would be nice if you wouldn't shoot my Juggernauts to death when I just put them... You know, I should probably be baiting. Yeah, I should definitely be baiting. I forgot to bait with the mine layer, but still, man. Stop shooting my juggernauts, man. He's nearly dead. Awesome. Cool. Now we gotta go all the way to the front. Oh my god. Stop disabling all my abilities. Oh, we're so dead. Look at the charger bosses, man. What do we even do? Spam. We need to spam. We don't have any money. <laughs> Never mind. Oh my days. Yeah, we're dead to charger bosses. You know, I'll just take the dub. Yeah, there's just no way we're going to kill these things. But you know what? That was fun. GG's. Okay, so the next one I have to spin a wheel to pick my loadout. But I'm also going to spin a wheel to pick what game mode I have to play as well. Because yes. All right, let's see what we get. Oh, sniper. Nice. Missile trooper. So far, so good, man. Juggernaut? Nah. EDJ, nice. Arm? And barracks. That's a good loadout. 
Okay, so we have to play elite mode. Now, the wheel gave us a great loadout, but when you think about it like this, there's only like, what, 15, 16 towers in the game? And when they're all pretty decent, when you think about it like that, it's pretty likely that I'll end up getting a decent to good loadout because the early game is going to be pretty easy. I'll see you guys later when we're in the late game. All right, here comes the boss. Our defense goes hard in the paint. All right, spam the snipers, bro. Let's go. Let's watch the barracks do the rest of the damage. Oh, and the missile troopers. <laughs> nice. GG boys. Next there, perma freeze some of the bosses. Bet. Oh my god, this is beautiful. <laughs> Let's give him the slowest death possible. <laughs> this is just stupid, bro. Oh my days, this is stupid. <laughs> Look at this, bro. It's so goofy. Oh my god, what, Bella. You can't even do anything. <laughs> Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content like this from me in the future. Have a great rest of you guys' day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.